What? What's going on? Earthquake. Oh. Uh, ah! We're fucked. No, I'm no. fucked. I'm fucked. Fuck. Hey everyone, I'm Cheryl K, and welcome to the Alien Cube. It's a new indie horror game that was released on Steam. It's it actually looked pretty cool. I didn't read the description at all, I just saw the trailer and I was like, alright, I'm gonna get this game. And we're gonna play it. Yeah. So this is our new game. It's as much as I could tell from the trailer, it's a little bit more chill, so it's not like constant jump scare shit. But yeah, I love aliens, I love cubes. Let's start a new game. If you're new to the channel, maybe you wanna maybe wanna start a new chapter in your life as well and subscribe. Yes, please thank you very much. The event. Uh, the most merciful thing in the world, I think, is uh, an ability of a human mind to correlate all its contents. Oh, interesting. Live on a placid island of ignorance in the midst of black seas of infinity. It was not meant that we should voyage far. H.P. Lovecraft. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, there's a long loading screen, but we can pass that. I'm gonna be a little bit harsh on the game because it's for real money. So just just so everybody knows. But uh, the game might be great, and I might not complain about anything. We never know. and shine oh it's that model again I swear to god I hate that model now I've seen it in so many games now where am I what am I doing here I don't know but see this guy fuck this guy I've seen him in so many games uh, do I have flashlight God damn it, I don't. Damn. But yeah, fuck this guy. Let's move on with our lives. Oh, oh. I'm stuttering. Why am I stuttering? Examine. How did I get here? What is this place? Wow. Great questions. Uh, it's auto saving. Let's go this way. Let's get the fuck out of this cave. Come on, you can... You can break a little bit out. From here I can see the outside. But the crack is too small to get through. Let's find another way. Yeah. Uh, how about make the crack bigger? Isn't that possible? I don't know, like kick it? You have like a lot of small rocks here. You can just like make it bigger. Cool, cool. I'm not gonna question your methods. Uh, let's move on. What is this? A fucking catatombs of Czech Republic? Can I die? I think I can fall and die. Uh, I'm gonna do it for science. Okay. So if you fall, you die. Ah, uh, we know, so we're never gonna do that ever again. So yeah, how's everyone doing? I'm still sick because of fucking COVID, as you can tell from my voice. God damn, this is too loud, hang on a second. Uh, game settings. Uh, apply. It didn't change nothing. I still hear it pretty loud. Cool, so what's this? Why are this gears for? Seems there's some huge machinery behind this wall. Yeah!
Who's lighting all these candles? Who's continuously coming here every like one hour to change the candles? Uh, are they like lit by eternal flame? Open up. It doesn't work. It seems that a gear is missing. <laughs> It was me trying to cough and laugh at the same time. But yeah, that didn't sound good at all. <laughs> ah. Take the gear. Now I'm scared for my life. You know, I, I don't need to see a monster yet. Let's just leave. Just leave. Fuck this guy. Uh, now you can open it. Yay! So we played it safe so far. The world looks beautiful. Yeah. Looks very beautiful. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, see? Why should I fuck with the monster if I could just... Okay, the jump is a little bit late. Like, I can hold it and then when I release the space button, it jumps, but... Hey! At least I can jump and I can run. Why am I stuttering? Hang on a second. Let me check out the options. I haven't played with those. Okay. Uh, I think I fixed the story. Uh, cool. Are there like secrets? This is a huge area to find small things. God damn, this looks so beautiful. I want to come here in real life. Uh, do I die? Oh, full damage? Okay, no. Uh, so as I was saying, this is beautiful and all, but... What? What's going on? Earthquake. Oh my ah! Ah! God. We're fucked. No, I'm no. fucked. No. I'm fucked. No. Fuck. I think I'm in the radius where I should be fucked now, like vaporized. You would think. But probably I got superpowers out of that. So. It's whispering. Shut the hell up. God damn it, I, I wanna see, I wanna see. Can I not see? God damn it, I can't. I can't get closer there. I can't, okay, okay, okay. Oh, there's like another way. Oh, oh, it is aliens after all. No, 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 I don't want to touch it. Don't touch it. Don't fucking touch it. God damn it. Why did you touch it? Did I touch it? Was I dreaming? Hopefully. What time is it? 8 a.m. That dream was so realistic and disturbing. Everything I felt was so real. I'm so tired. I need to go in the bathroom to freshen up. Cool. Uh, so here's where I live. Pretty gloomy apartment. Why do I have boxes here? I can't jump in my own house. I don't know why. No, 
Okay, cool. Uh, press J to open and close the journal. My dreams. Tonight, I find myself writing on the pages of my journal once more, hoping it helps me to fall asleep and to find peace again. Nights are troubled by sudden and unexplainable awakenings. More and more often, immediately afterwards, bathed in sweat, I feel terribly tired and have an unpleasant feeling that I've experienced something un upsetting that I don't remember. Uh, get yourself tested for COVID. That's how I felt. <laughs> On second thoughts, though all of this could be due to recent events, the breakup with Jenny. Okay. <laughs> the move and finally my uncle Edgar disappearance. The later event in particular must have upset me more than I'd have expected. Considering the unclear nature of the facts, what the newspaper reports is very strange indeed. Only God knows what happened to him. And maybe it doesn't either. You never know. Uh, my new home hasn't helped me to improve my situation. Perhaps it's just too early. I need more time. Yeah, perhaps you have a shit ton of money to afford an apartment with such a huge kitchen and dining area. I'm just saying. Where I live, I'm... It's pretty expensive, but I don't have half this shit. The move was exhausting. I still have to arrange so many things. Yeah, looks like it. Yeah, I was wondering what the fuck was with, with the box. Switch. Can I turn the TV on? Can I listen to the cassette player? Fireplace. Cozy. I love warmth of fire when it's cold outside. It's always cold outside. What? I got a key. Computer. That's my new. Co this isn't your new computer. What the? What year is it? Cost me a small fortune. It will allow me to work. What? Work more often from home, though. Yeah. What? What are you doing? Making YouTube videos? I do that as well. You have something in common. All right. Uh, this is the door to outside. Ah, oh, doggy! I love doggy. Where's the toilet? Well, oh, here's the bathroom. My dude, you're fucking rich. Are you kidding me? Can I can I flush the toilet? God damn it! Not even paid games on Steam have flushing toilet. Well, time to wash our ass. Interesting. Can't stop thinking about that dream. It was as if that strange object was calling me. I was feeling it deep. Feeling all prime. God damn it! I'm trying to read. I can't read. <laughs> Who's at the door? Oh, it's probably the postman. And I'm probably a vampire. I don't have a reflection, so yeah. Okay, bye, dude. I'm gonna check my shit first. Switch. Okay, okay, we have a ironing room. Hmm. What did I order? A letter. Uh, okay, your uncle like this, so we have to give him an uncle voice. Also, oh dear nephew. If you are reading this letter, it means that I am God. I gave instructions to a close friend to deliver this message to you in the event that something bad should happen to me. In the last few years, we lost contact with one another. I know and I am sorry for that. My life changed a lot. And I am only a shadow of the man you knew when you were a child. I know that... It was hard for you, not knowing who your mother was, especially after your father's death. I haven't always been there for you, but I was going through a rough patch. I hope you can forgive me for that. As you know, I have never been married or had children. My cat is hating the voice I'm giving. Just, <laughs> just hear him meowing nonstop. 
Okay, I'm sorry, cat. Sorry. I, I have to commit. So I decided to leave you all my positions, even though I don't owe a lot. Your inheritance consists of my apartment and the old cabin in the mountain. Okay, okay, cat, I'm gonna stop. My cat hates it. Mm. Which belonged to your grandparents. This is all I have left. The apartment is situated in the building at number 13. Great. Oldwood Street in Winter Falls is quite old and in bad condition, but I could not afford anything better amongst my belongings. You will probably find some things you won't be able to make sense of. I ask you to discard everything without question. I'm referring in particular to my manuscripts. They are very personal and, as you will perhaps have been told, writing was my only solace in my darkest days. I ask you therefore not to read them and not delve into my research. Get rid of everything so that nothing can be found. You will find the apartment key in the envelope. Do what you desire with it, but I beg you to respect my last wish. I will not do that. I'm gonna read everything. I have always loved you, your Uncle Edgar. A uh, cool Uncle Edgar. Thank you for the key, and now I leave. Can't go out of my, in my pajamas. What? I can go however the fuck I want to go. Okay, fine. I'm gonna change. I mean, I don't have a reflection. I don't even exist. So I don't understand what I'm changing. It'll be a long trip. I'm gonna take my cassette player so I can listen to some good music. Where is it? Uh, that I don't know, buddy. Food. Eat your food. Nom 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 nom. Don't drink alcohol because we're gonna drive. Okay. Cassette player, huh? Milk, eggs, juice, dish soap, rat poison, uh, call Pete back. Who is Pete? I don't know of a Pete. If I'm a cassette player, where would I be? Not here, probably. Right? Is it here in the bedroom? Have a scale. You would think it would be in the bedroom. No? Telephone? I should call Jennifer, but not now. I just want to leave a chill day. To have a chill day, sorry. There's a cassette. Where's the cassette player? Books. Clock. Computer. Where's the fucking cassette player? I'm starting to get mad. Yeah, cassettes everywhere is a damn player. Oh, of course, here it is. My cassette player, I'm not going anywhere without that. Cool, can I collect the cassettes now? No? Alright, let's leave. Goodbye! No, I don't care, Edgar. And we're on the way. Chapter 2 The Apartment Disappeared more than a week ago, yet I've just received a letter from him only to find out that I'm his sole heir. It's such a long time since I last saw him. I was only a child at that time, but he must have 
been found fond enough of me to leave me his possessions as a legacy. Okay? I've never seen where he moved to in the last few years. But after having driven for many hours, I finally reached my destination. The address given in the letter led me here, to this old building in the worst district in Winter Falls. Okay? The apartment should be up there on the top floor. Cool, uh, and now we wait. Cool. This screams haunted. I mean, Jesus fucking Christ. This is very scary. Can I take this soda at least? There's a there's an arrow here. Can I do something about it? Uh Demons Drowned. I died here. Cool. <laughs> This is not the right apartment. Are you sure? Alone. Someone brought the bike all the way to the top floor in this building. Why? It's a lot of effort for no reason. Hmm. This is not the right place. Yeah, where where is the right place? Statue it. What? What 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 did I get? Yeah, found the secret. Yeah, I wanna see it. Where's the fucking statue? Uh, I tab. Uh, I guess I don't know how to open my inventory yet. If I have one. Okay, he said it's the top floor. This is the top floor, right? Where is the fucking right apartment, dude? There's no reason to go this way. How do you know? So it should be here. Now uh, what about you? Uh, what about you? Uh, what about you? Here it is. This is Edgar's flat. I opened it with the power of the mind. The lights were on all this time. <laughs> <laughs> Not only the lights, my dude. Not only the lights. Uh, Uncle Edgar, I'm sorry, but goodbye. Love you and all, buddy, but... Jesus balonies, I'm leaving. There's no reason to go... There's a huge reason! There's a fucking demon inside the apartment. Are you kidding me? Uh, fine, I'm gonna be the dumb protagonist. I wonder what's going on. Who's here? It's gonna be that person. Uh, demon? Love you, buddy. Don't attack me. I'm a poor soul. Very poor soul. Examine. There's mold and dirt everywhere. Did Uncle Edgar ever clean? Doesn't look like it, does it now? There's a book here. Huh. Well, his bathroom is exactly like mine, except dirty. <laughs> this is awfully squeaky. Uh, turn on the damn light. Doesn't work. That's not good. What happened to this mirror? Uh, yeah. Looks like shit. That's what happened. There's a drawer. Drawer is locked. Of course it is. Uh, there's a page. Page from Edgar's journal. Cool, cool, cool. Finally, after many years, I returned to the old family home. Unfortunately, when I arrived, I saw that nothing of the house was left. Everything has been reduced to a sad pile of problems. Cool. However, it was there. 
among all the derbs debris sorry all the all the derbs <laughs> all the debris that I found that strange chest although clearly very ancient it was exquisitely crafted made from fine wood and decorated with strange geometric symbols that I had never seen before at first I didn't notice this as when I was a child I was used to seeing all kinds of bizarre objects around the house found who knows where by my father during one of his countless journeys uh, the chest however had something sinister and mysterious about it so I decided to extract it from the debris and try to open it I hope that writing this journal will help me overcome my sh shock or my discovery because what I found inside that terrible chest is not something that could belong to this world uh, cool Edgar where is the chest why? Why am I so horrible playing the piano? Dun 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 dun. Oh, cool. So where's this chest that you're talking about? I wanna see it. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna. Excuse me? Oh, fuck you too, buddy. I just got the apartment. You don't have to break shit. Do you have squatters here? Mechanism. A strange mechanism fitted into the wood. Something has been removed, showing the gears. Uh, okay. There's pizza. A lot of pizza. Door. That's weird. There's no handle. That's very weird. Stereo. Cool. Dun, 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 dun. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Let's see who's fucking my kitchen. It won't open. There's something on the other side that's blocking the door. Hey! Knock it off! You fucking asshole! This is my. This is my house now. You know, this is my fucking house. I need to leave. Who turned this shit on? Ow! 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 I, I, maybe I shouldn't touch it. Uh, ow. Uh, Jesus. Are you sure you don't want to leave this apartment, my dude? It's trying to kill you. The house is trying to kill you. Are you, are you dumb? Yes, yeah, go through, I guess. This guy is stupid as hell. Well, <laughs> now we know it wasn't a demon that's blocking the way, it was just a shell that fell down. Leave the door open, thank you very much. Doesn't work. Cool. Painting. Strange crack beneath the painting. Maybe I can move it? Isn't this like the. like. Babel, Babel Tower, whatever it's called. I can't move it, it's firmly fixed on the wall. Cool, uh, what else do we have? Ow! Why did I eat that? Oh my fucking god, I'm dumb. That food was spoiled, I shouldn't have eaten it. Yeah, I didn't realize you are gonna eat it, I thought you are gonna examine it. And say like, oh, this has been left here for a long time. See, like this. Terrible smell here. How could my uncle live in these conditions? He didn't. He died. Remember? The aliens took him. It's the alien cube. You understand? Okay, okay. Ah, oh, what that disgusting substance. It smells horrible. I don't like the idea at all. But I can try to get through that hole. You go through, there's nothing else to do it. At the moment. Oh, no! What? Aliens don't wear shoes. Who the fuck stomped my face? That's my beauty maker, you piece of shit. Fuck you. Don't, don't kick my face. Oh, you think so? The God's Eye. Ooh. 
Yes, my lord. My lord. How did he say that I'm not gonna bother them and he didn't finish the job? He didn't kill me. Yeah, you got stomped on. am I? I have no idea, but they left me they left me a cushion. So they're not that bad. Here's a grid. It looks quite weak. Maybe I'll be able to break it. You break the shit. Probably locked. Yeah. Passage is narrow, but I have to try. Yeah, come on. Oh, it's next to the toilet. Ew. Alright. My dude. We have some puzzles. Documents. October 30th. The disappearance of old William's son, Edgar Mitchell, caused us quite a few problems. It has been hard to keep track of every officer, but fortunately they didn't find out anything at the scene of the fire. The purpose of that building must remain secret at all costs. At the moment, the case is in the hands of our men in the police. That detectives won't set foot in our territories anymore. Oh. Okay, this is like secret organization shit. However, we must find out what happened to Edgar and close the case before someone else snoops around, like me. <laughs> we start by checking his apartment. November 5th. We have proof of the existence of the God's Eye. The priestess was right. Priestess? What? Now, yeah, now you're throwing all kinds of characters at my face. During the inspection of Edgar's apartment, we found some papers belonging to his father, old William. Everything suggests that he was in possession of this sacred artifact without us knowing it. How is it possible that such a trusted member of our or of the order Oh okay, so we are an organization betrayed us. We are trying to understand where his hiding place is. All signs point a location out of town. Where there used to be an ancient village inhabited by our ancestors. Okay. Uh, there's photos. Yeah, this is the mechanism. This is the Babel Tower. Uh, don't you remember this? A hatch. Cool, 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 cool. Thank you. I love. I love some hints, that's for sure. Okay, here's where he stumped the fuck out of me. Screwdriver, thank you. What the hell is this? Looks like some kind of cocoon. Yeah, it's not something I wanna fuck with, I'm gonna, I guess. Okay, there's nothing else to do here. I love how I found this secret first thing in the game. <laughs> cool, 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 cool. Yeah, let's... Let's go through again. I swear to god if he stomps me again. I'm fucking done, dude. Good, 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 good. good. So... There was... There was a thing that I need to... Touch. That's where there's no alley. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Uh, what did I write in the journal? Oh, okay. I never have imagined. Let's let's leave the journal for now. Let's leave the journal. We're gonna read it like every two, three ones. Oh, we can read it at every episode because this game seems to be a little long. So at the start of each episode, we can read the journal. To catch up on what happened. That's it. Use a screwdriver, my dude. Whatever. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, I see the bubble thing, but where was that? Where was that uh, like cuckoo clock? I don't know what to say. Yeah. 
Where's the hatch? Here's the hatch. Trap door. It's stuck. Cool. Uh, so I need to find that corner. Like, there's a picture taken at a corner, and I need to find that. Would you look at that? I can use a screwdriver and the grate here. And that should give me something. Hopefully. Uh, see it crouch. Yeah, sure. Uh, small key. This goes to the drawer. In the bedroom here, right? Yes. It all makes sense now. <laughs> After that horrific discovery finding discovery finding the answers to my questions became a real obsession so i started to study my father's old papers in depth my research uncovered the existence of a mysterious order Ooh, its origins are extremely ancient illuminati apparently it still exists today indeed i found clear reference to it in my father's notes and it seems that he was even a member Oh shit. <laughs> I also found out that in addition to the old cabin in the mountains, my father owned many other properties scattered around the area I didn't even know. Why didn't he tell me about them? There was one, maybe because it's a secret fucking order and you're gonna write random papers in your house about it. Your dad was doing the right thing. There was one place in particular that was very important to him. And it seems that he did everything to keep it a secret. I made a map showing it so exactly. You fucking suck. You can't keep your dad's secret. I made a map showing its location. I'm going to go there immediately. Yeah, why why not just go there without trying about it? Uh Black Hill Forest. Cool. Uh, so now we have a map. I better go there right away. I'll come back here later. Those who have imprisoned me are heading there. If I hurry, I can arrive first and find out more about what's going on. Okay, so now I'm leaving? What about the rest of the puzzles? Probably I'm gonna find pieces there. I better go now. I'll come back later. Yeah, okay, 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 cool, cool. Uh, here I go! Uh, I think this is fairly a place to stop first video the first part I almost died a couple times so that's fair yeah let's let's end the video before I exit so yeah uh, the alien cube so far it's been really promising I love it already it's pretty cool I still don't understand what the hell is going on but yeah if you enjoyed this video maybe you want to like it comment your feelings about it and subscribe to the channel if you haven't but we're gonna we're gonna play through this game for sure I'm enjoying it so far. And yeah, like always, just like your parents tell them, like your grandparents tell them. Everyone's telling everyone nowadays. Even your gr grand grand grandpa, who's belonging to the Illuminati and never told you to shoot for the stars. <laughs>